Brandon Lewis. I run the Performing Arts Center at STAG, and this is my, this will be my 10th full year. I've been here for nine and a half years. I was a January hire. Cinema Club started six years ago and it was just kind of a group of students who really wanted to get involved in just making films. Um, we did a couple like 45 minute long films, we did a lot of shorter things. We were asked to be involved in uh, the district wide play on sports initiative which is basically IHSA uh, runs or has a company who runs a video production uh, site specifically used for uh, football games and basketball games and any sporting event that the IHSA does. Now that we were bringing graduation back home, uh, we wanted to be able to stream out live so the people who either couldn't make it or were out of town or something like that had a chance to be able to watch graduation. So the students wanted to get creative and they wanted to use it for other things. So then they started doing multiple camera angles for uh, some of the games. They started wanting to do the choir concerts and the band concerts so people who couldn't be here for those were able to actually watch those online. Um, and then even the directors started using that as a learning tool too. Uh, they'll have the students watch the concerts after the fact or have it as a homework assignment to watch the concert and then they were able to uh, kind of dissect their own performance during a concert so that they were able to learn what they could have maybe done better so that they can uh, you know be better for the next concert. Today we do uh, 10 major productions. Um, we've and every single one of those by major production we means that it's we mean that it has uh, lights, sound, uh, some sort of scenery, uh, and some sort of costumes. We I started using an iPad in the Performing Arts Center about four years ago. Um, our uh, soundboard actually is. Um, completely Wi-Fi enabled so I was able to set up uh, my own network um, to the soundboard. I can actually use my iPad to run every aspect of the soundboard. Our light board uh, has an, its own network also so um, I can run the lights from anywhere in the entire Performing Arts Center um, which is really nice particularly when it's show week and there are some changes that need to be made kind of on the fly. Um, I can actually be watching rehearsal directing a show and I can have the software up on my iPad where I can just change you know some of light changes in the middle of a performance. Uh, well, maybe not a performance, but in the middle of a rehearsal. One of the bigger reasons that I use my iPad is for marching band. Um, we actually have all of our drill charts, uh, which show where each individual student is supposed to be in their forms. Uh, we have that all on our iPads. So when we're running uh, shows, we can just you know swipe and we're into their next set, swipe to their next set. It's really nice because we can also zoom. So sometimes they're in really like very specific positions that's hard to see on a piece of paper, but being able to zoom, where you can you know find out where they're supposed to go. We also use it for uh, tuners. Uh, uh, we also use it for our metronomes, so when I work with the drum majors, my iPad often will be at the drum majors' feet, you know, showing what tempos are supposed to be, or me using it to make sure that they're at the right tempos. because the, the whole point of everything you do in here is to try to educate the students to see what they can, what is available and what's possible. And it's just so important to be able to be on the top, on the, you know, at the front of technology because it is rapidly changing. We have uh, a bunch of LED lights that we bought about seven years ago. Um, and now LED is the giant craze in theatrical lighting. And we actually have students who are now in college who are using the same lights that we've had. And uh, the best thing that ever happened like literally the best thing was I had a student who uh, is at Purchase University in New York City and um, she was in her lighting class and uh, they were asking a whole bunch of questions uh, about new lighting and all this kind of stuff and she knew the answers to all the questions and this uh, uh, her teacher just looked at her and said what did you go to a really awesome high school or something because it's ridiculous how much you know and that's exactly the point like the point is so that when they leave here they're a step ahead and that they know what to expect and what they can do creatively because they have had that experience you know